Hey, welcome to Wayne's World. It's me, Dwayne the Booze and Blogger, coming at you. With elections freshly over, uh, I guess that's what we're going to talk about today. So stay tuned, and I'll be right back. Dwayne's World! Dwayne's World! Dwayne's World! Hey, welcome to Dwayne's World. It's me, Dwayne the Booze and Blogger, coming at you on a rainy Tuesday after election 2019. See, even the fucking clouds are fucking pissed off about that, the election results. So, the Liberals win. Fuck. I don't understand how Trudeau did it. He should have been sunken. A silver lining of all this, he's got a minority government. So he can't do everything on his own, which is good, because that keeps the little fucker in check. And he needs the help of the other parties in order to push through legislations and stuff. And chances are, a bunch of his stuff will get shot down. There's chances we can get rid of him before the four years probably better than not we're going to sit back we'll watch what he does and uh like i said the other parties have some say in this they've taken some of the power away from the little fuck and he can't just go spending money like crazy that's a good thing i think i actually don't mind a minority government it'd be the same way if sheer had a one i would you know if he had a minority government at least you can have to keep him in check too um so yeah i don't even think a minority government's a bad thing um, sure, you can get oustered with non-confidence votes and shit, but that's a way to keep everybody in check, you know? They know that anywhere just around the corner, they can be gone. I don't get that Sheer won the popular vote. I still think that's ridiculous. To me, the person who should be running the country is the person who has the most votes, and if you have the most votes, you got, you're the popular vote. Um... I don't get how that doesn't happen. It happened in the States, too. Like, I mean, Hillary had the popular vote and dipshits in charge. So, we need political reform all around North America. Holy fuck. Get these people out of there. But, one thing is for sure. We don't have to watch these terrible fucking ads where they're both PCs and the liberals are fucking going at it. Don't vote for Sheer. Don't vote for Trudeau. Fucking, this guy's an asshole. That guy's an asshole. This one... Good. I don't want... I got sick of that watching that because that isn't Canadian. Um, you know, that fucking digging up all the dirt and bullshit is... That's an American style of fucking way to go and we shouldn't be doing that. Um, we're a nicer country and we should have been more sportsmanlike towards each other. Um, but yeah, both parties did it. I know Shearer's party did it. Probably more, but Trudeau's fucking... I saw just as many bad ads from him, too, calling out Shear. So, what do you do? So we sit back and we wait. You know it's going to happen. Justin's going to get a vote of non-confidence. Is it going to be this month, this year, next year? Don't know. It's going to happen, though. I'll fucking guarantee it. Mind you, I shouldn't guarantee it. I guarantee he wouldn't be fucking in power this time around, either. Um, I think... The PCs would have been better off if they had got somebody different other than Sheer. I still hold by my true belief that you um, you have a, in power a single mom. I still believe in that. They're the ones who are going to fix shit up. You know, they're compassionate enough, but they're also responsible with money. Fuck. So maybe that... Here, if you're listening, conservatives, that's what you want. A single mom. I'm sure there's one in your fucking party somewhere. But, at least the fucking election is done. Thank fucking God. I'm tired of it. Minority government's a good thing, folks. Uh, like I said, even if Sheer had a minority government, it wouldn't bother me. Just, uh... Keep these fuckers in check because politicians are all fucking criminals and crooks as far as I'm concerned. They all lie their asses off and then we find out what they're going to do when they get in power. Anyways, this is Dwayne, the Booze and Blogger from Dwayne's World coming at you. Uh, subscribe to my channel right down there in the corner. Just click that button. I can you always use more subscribers. If you haven't subscribed, why haven't you? Holy fuck, I give you great content every week. Uh, come back next week. I'm gonna have. I'm gonna do a shot on location. Actually, it'll be my first time having people around while I'm doing this. So tune in next week. 
Remember, subscribe, share it on Facebook. Uh, have yourselves a great week, and remember, don't be a fucking asshole. Twenty-four. Twenty-four.